Welcome back to yet another Star Stable video. Please be sure to like and subscribe if you haven't already. And today we have brand new Halloween horses and raven pets. So let's just get right into the video then. And yeah, let's go. Okay, so here we are and there's this. It's time for Halloween. Pass through the portal to join the party and meet the new magical horses Song Sorrow and Dusk Grim. I kept saying Song Sparrow, but that just makes more sense. Okay, but where is the portal? What <laughs> portal? Check it out. Okay, that's so helpful. Thank you, Star Stick. Where is this portal? I don't know where to go. I'm lost. I I forgot where the portal is. How do you know where the portal is though? Is it like at every home stable? Was that it? It's been a while. Or is it the one portal that's somewhere in Golden Hills? I don't know. Best um it was. It is. I see the portal. Yes, I knew it was right. Oh my goodness, yes. Okay, I did not know they were gonna bring back Galloper's Keep with this update. I did not know that. That's kind of a big update, not gonna lie. But it's a little introduction. Oh, there's a raven! We love it. Or a crow. I'm sorry. Or okay, what is this? Oh, there's collectibles. I am so happy. Okay, so we have this floating pieces here beautiful oh there's probably music that's why no i'm i'm not hearing the music okay it's it's just kind of a random twirl of the camera okay i love that i got all halloweenified this girl stole my hat Busty. casper casper stole my hat <laughs> give it back casper why you gotta be like this okay so oh my goodness there is so much okay we got the maskies oh and the new pumpkin set are you serious i am so excited to check that out okay we have the new sets some magic stardust i don't like magic stardust though because it's temporary and oh no it scares me because it's temporary i don't the pumpkin hunt <laughs> ew bestie i love the pumpkin hunt. Ha ha ha. Okay, what's this? A living soul in this cruel place. We're checking out the horses on this video, but definitely stay tuned for more. So yeah, but let's check out the horses. Okay, here we go. <gasps> and the pet lady. What do you have? <gasps> Wait, look. It stands on your saddlebag like that. It is so cute. They're 379 star coins though, so they are kind of expensive bestie, but they're so cute. You have the Dawn Wing Raven. Ravens are a common companion of Dusk Grimm's. Those seeking guidance would do well to find a white Dawn Wing Raven as a friend, as they are good omens symbolizing new opportunities and bright futures. They search for shiny objects and new plant growth. Well, that new plant growth bestie, you could get yourself a raven. Okay, ravens are a common companion of Duskrims, though feared by m their appearance and reputation. Duskwing ravens are neutral signs of transition. It will remind you to rest a moment and reflect before continuing to learn something new. They love learning new tricks. But you should be resting on my reflecting raven. This is actually scary though. Like, what is this? Look at his face. It's like staring into your soul. Like, what is that about? I don't like it. Do we have a ghost cat pet? We don't, only she gets it. Little Miss Lady Goodwill, is that your name? Now it is. Okay, so here we go. We have this one. No, I literally love it so much. I think it's a Perlino, you guys were saying, and it has like rose gold tipped hair. I love it so much. And then we have this one, which is the, so this one's Song Sorrow. They skizzled me, what is that? This one's Dust Grim. Best star stable, but that doesn't make sense. So here we go. We have two options. Let's see some close up, close up um goodness here to see what we have. This one, it has a little spikies. And this one, I love this one's coat so much. Like this one is so cute. Okay, wait, I need to see their magicals coat again because I kind of forgot. That one's the raven. And Song Sorrow is the one that's not the raven. 
Why? Why? And Duskrim is the one that is the rape. That makes sense. Okay. Okay, so this one is Jorvik is rich with tales of nature spirits appearing as horses. Two of these horses are strongly linked to dark stories, reminding the listener that experience as appearances are deceiving. The Duskrims of the barren mountains look deadly, even though they come to help. On the flip side, song sorrows may seem tame, even pitiful, until it is too late to escape the vis vicious water horse. Myths tell of a horse followed by ravens descending to Jorvik and appearing to an unsuspecting person. The inky black horse charges at the human, fearsome appearance and cawing ravens, driving the person away in terror. Later, the person finds tra tragedy has struck. Unaware, the Duskrim appeared to guide them from disaster. The well-meaning spirit is treated as an omen of doom, their mere presence bringing despair, even though they come to help. Despite the disturbing legends, a white Duskrim is the good luck, a messenger for a fate, a brought bright new dawn. Okay, that is good. The legend interestingly tried to Yorvik landscape. Blah, blah. Okay, there we go. And this one? This one is probably a Kelpie, am I right? Song sorrows are Yorvik's waters given threatening form. Yet nearly every beach, river, and lake has at least one story of a song sorrow. In some accounts of water source was created by the horse's tears after losing their rider and now the spirit waits for the rider's return crying a haunting song that lures the unsuspecting onto their back the person may be released when the song sorrow realizes the human on their back is not the one they're waiting for the only possibility is the song sorrow in a grief stricken rage will drag the human into the water never to be seen again. Deadly your water is never to be seen. Okay, that's kind of brutal, but okay. <laughs> <laughs> um, versatile temperament. They can be calm or dangerous, frozen or boiling, and should be treated with caution. Incredibly intelligent and social, unaware of stories they are part of. They reward those who show them kindness and unwavering loyalty, earning the trust of a Duskrim to earn a friend for life and perhaps beyond. That's so kind. This one's like so kind and gentle, and this one's like, yeah, I'm me, I'm- I know, it just- I know, it just- <laughs> It just, I don't have a reason. I don't have a reason. It just kind of, it just kind of makes sense. Okay, let's see, we'll name it Egg. No, okay, let's see, random. Caramel Bullet, I'll be back once I choose a name. I'm gonna name it Rising River. That sounds very dangerous, or maybe Root River. Oh no, I like Root. Root? No, rising river to make it sound dangerous and lovely. So we're going to buy it. Oh my gosh, I did not mean to actually buy it. I wanted to look at the other one a bit more. Okay, well, that's good. That's good. We bought it. That is very good. Okay, now we're going to go back. And I think that I might actually end up buying both of them this video. So yeah, we'll definitely have to stay tuned for that. I don't know if we're going to be buying the the little raven o's because expensive o's but you know was, um okay kira <laughs> lovely little trick you got going on there but let's go back and check out rising river and then i love this horse so much i actually really do like both of them have super good non maps and super good magical codes okay i'm calling for pickup i'm not dealing with that hill i'm not dealing with that hill that's <laughs> too much of a struggle we're not dealing with that okay do we have a portal here? Oh, we do. There's nothing to fear. We do have a portal. I knew it. I knew it, guys. You could trust. Oh my, this is so cute. Wait, they have little ghosts and stuff. I'm sorry, pumpkin spice, but you gotta go, bestie. Look, they're both like zombie horses. Oh my goodness, guys. I'm starting a zombie horse collection. That's my- <laughs> why do I have zombie horses? They look like zombies, though. This one has such a sad backstory. I can't even. Rising River. Okay, well, apparently we're their riders, so they're not gonna drag us, or that would be kind of, um, brutal. But anyways, here's Rising River. Look! It's mane. I'm liter- it's mane. Look, instead of little hair strands, they made the mane have the strands. And I love that. I love the strands. That is like a whole new level of love. I love the strands. They are. They made them like ivy just coming out of the mane. Look, I have way too many Rivik Wilds now. <gasps> Someone bought the other one. Someone- Bestie just teleported and evaporated out of existence. 
for me. No, uh, I cannot change the hairstyle. Oops, hey, his. Okay, so if you buy the horses, I don't know about the other one, but if you buy my bestie here, um, Song Sorrow. Sorry, Song Sorrow, I literally thought you were Dust Grim for like eternity, because just doesn't make sense. But anyways, this is basically like a mermaid. Oh, I forgot that happens when you get close to it. Okay, I literally love this horse so much though in non-magical form and even in magical form. Kind of reminds me of a zombie though, not gonna lie. But I mean, it's beautiful. Just look at these eyes. The horse is so much. And the ivy in the hair, it's not, it's seaweed. It's seaweed, I'm sorry for that little misinterpretation there. It's seaweed, I love the seaweed in the hair. And this is just glorious. Look at its mane, it like, ombres into the tail and stuff. It is just glorious. Oh my goodness, we are definitely going to have a montage of these two, and I think we're gonna go back and buy the other one. It's been a while since I bought all the horses that were for sale, so I think we're gonna do it. Oh my gosh, someone has the creepy pumpkin blend. I kind of like it though, because it's like Halloween and it's creepy, but I can't be the only one that sees it as creepy, right? Let me know in the comments if you see that balloon as creepy. It's literally like this. I can't even. That is so creepy. Okay, the Halloween American Quarter Horse is back, by the way. In case you're wondering, all of these lovely horses are back. But here is the next one, and I think we're going to get it just because... Okay, let's see. We need a good name. I'll be back once I thought of a good name. I don't know. I could do Raven Rising, but... And match them. But I don't know. It's not red, though. Bestie, what am I doing? Raven Omen, because it's literally an omen. Oh my god. I'm so sorry. I'm so smart. I'm so smart. I'm so smart. Okay, we're going back to the home stable. It's definitely been a while since I bought two horses in a row, so that's kind of a lot. Ha they were like a lot of money, too. They weren't like 950 per se, but they were like... <laughs> you know, so, um, yeah, they were like that. Oh, my bestie Kiara's still doing her trick. It's okay, I see you, Kiara. I hope you survive that. Hope you survive. Look, this one has a patching horse. Oh, I didn't get to see. Never mind. Oh, you get dropped off where you took it? That is so good. Oh, it's like a little free ticket back home. That is so good. Okay. Well, we're gonna do the montage of Rising River first, so stay tuned for that, and then afterwards, we can check out. Oh, you know what I just realized? Look at the bottom of this horse. It's like water ripples. I can't. I'm sorry, but Song Sorrow, it has to be my favorite. There's literally water ripples on it. That detail. I'm just a detailistic person. You know, guys. No. Dun, 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 dun. Okay, I guess let's take up a very close look at these horses just in case you guys missed anything so you can be sure which one you want to buy okay let's take a close look okay so on this one i just realized i can't go first person okay let me make it a little bit better better let me just zoom in okay there so on this one on its magical form there's water ripples on its stomach that's a reason that's a reason i love the water ripples just look at that and then on its tail, it's kind of like, I don't know, the, the seaweed changes color, in case you're wondering. From like silver to this. And it kind of has ombre to kind of like a purplish color, I would say. Reminds me of like swamp slash zombie. And also its eyes. Yeah, yeah, awesome eyes. <gasps> Guys, there's ghost horses! It just glitched! <gasps> That scared me, literally. I forgot that existed. I forgot that existed. That's kind of creepy though. 
Okay, anyways, we're not thinking about that. Um, so here we are, and as you could see, some details. Its eyes still kind of stayed like a misty color, and it has the seaweeds like more muted. I really like that Star Stable changed the seaweed to muted color because that's way easier to match outfits with, not gonna lie. And then it kind of ombres to gray, and the water ripples on its stomach are gone. So those are basically all of it. It kind of, it walks exactly and like has the exact same stripe structure as a Yorvik wild if you didn't notice I'm just here for you so yeah it does have that Yorvik wild feel to it um totally not because it is Yorvik wild but yeah so that is everything I would say about this horse I love song sorrow like I'm sorry it's just so good and raven omen wait it's literally like velvet this horse is literally like velvety wait calm down my bestie duskrim Okay, this horse literally is like velvet. Zoom in, you see? It got that feathery goodness for you, okay? I, why am I like marketing these horses? <laughs> okay, anyways, but we're looking at the details. It got that feathery goodness. And look at its mane. Also got that feathery goodness. See that? And it kind of looks like, not how you call it, not luminescent. It looks not hollow. Iridescent. It looks iridescent. It does. Like, look at that mane. It looks like an oil spill. Okay, bestie? So that's... <laughs> well, you can name it that, but it, it has the colors of an oil spill. So in case you're a little bit curious, that is the colors. And also on way on its hooves, it kind of has a different pattern as well. Like it kind of has a feathery pattern instead of this. No, that's really interesting. And on its stomach, there's nothing. But up front here on its chest, it does have that kind of oil spill vibe. And the thing I love about this horse is its non-magical form at this wait okay wait stop wait okay there we go we got its eyes open its eyes go to this like pale blue to turquoise and white eyelashes I need to get those white eyelashes it's beautiful it's just the cutest i don't even know what it's literally the cutest and I, it has like rose gold dyed tip hair you know like if you were to mute the color rose gold that would be it and then, oh um, no, that's kind of it. It's just a regular horse. But of course they have to hide. So what do you expect? So yeah, this is the Raven Omen. And we're going to check if we can change their hairstyle. Probably not. But I want to be sure, just in case you're wondering before you buy the horses, if you could change their main styles. We're going to check it out for you guys because... That would kind of suck if you think you can, and then you can't. Stop, I asked to buy your goods, and you can't. So just so you know, if you want to buy these horses, you cannot change their main styles, okay? Message, message to you, just stay tuned for that. And now we're going to have a short montage of Raven Omen, so yeah. Okay, so yeah, we did end up buying both of them. So I hope you enjoyed this video, guys, my besties. But thank you so, so much for watching. I very much appreciate it. And let me know in the comments if you'll be getting Song Sorrow, Song Sorrow, or Duskrim. By the way, this one's Duskrim. Might have messed that up, but we're not gonna talk about that. Um, but yeah, so let me know which one you'll be getting and what you think of the Halloween Relum. It is back and stay tuned for pumpkin picking and all that fun stuff. So yeah. Bye everyone. Thank you so much for watching the Star Stable video. As always, please be sure to like and subscribe if you haven't already as I post new Star Stable videos every single day and stay tuned for more. And yeah, thank you so much for watching. I very much appreciate it.